This is question number four. You are told so five over three minus two x less less than one minus two over three x less than or equals to two minus uh, x. Hence list the the integral values that satisfies the inequality. So for you to be able to do this, uh, uh, you run this in inequalities in form two. So you first of all take that inequality, and then you 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 be able to work on the other one. So let's say th this is uh, five over three minus two x uh, less than one minus two over three x. So we put the right terms together. So we can take two to the other side. This will be five over three. Uh, this will become one minus one. Uh, less than uh, here we have two x it will be positive and here we have two over three x so this is one and a third so if we subtract one uh, we, we, this is one and two that so we'll be left with two that because it is one and two that so if you subtract one you'll be left with two that less than uh, this is two x minus uh, 2 over 3x so this will be 1 and a third x uh, therefore we have uh, 2 over 3 uh, less than this will be 4 over 3x so we multiply both sides we'll be able to get x or rather let's put it like that 2 over 3 uh, you multiply by 3 you divide by 4 uh, is less than x so if you multiply uh, 3 over 4 here, you, you'll be left with uh, x. So we simplify here and we say by 2 is 2, by 2 is 1, by 3 is 1, by 3 is 1. So this means that uh, we can write our x, uh, uh, that is uh, x is uh, greater than, uh, this is uh, a half, that's a half. Uh, so we have worked out that one. Uh, we come to this we work out this one so here we'll be able to get uh, this is equals to this will be 1 uh, minus 2 over 3 x uh, less than or equals to 2 minus x so we can take the x to the other side you have x uh, minus 2 over 3 x and we take 1 to the other side you have two my it becomes minus once it crosses the equal sign so two minus one x minus two over three that will give us a third x uh, is less than or equals to one two minus one is one so we multiply both sides by three so we multiply by three over one multiply by three over one so that will disappear with that so we'll be left with x is less than or equals to this will be equals to the less than or equals to 3. So from there, we can now combine, say, x is less than or equals to 3, and x is greater than a half. So to be able to write the, the integral values in between a half and 3, uh, 3 is inclusive because it is re x is less than or equals to 3, then our integral values will be 1, uh, 2, and three so that's how you work out that and you'll be able to get three marks